today's video is a little bit of a life update. Um, I feel like on social media, people don't get to show all of their life, I guess you could say. They only show like the highlights and this video is kind of like those not so fun highlighted parts in my life at least. Um, I've actually had a very hard couple of weeks and um, I just want to share with you some things that have been going on in my life that I feel like need to be brought up because I feel like I'm definitely not the only person to be going through some of these things. And so I just wanted to, I guess, share with you that uh, obviously my life is not perfect, but um, I don't know. I just feel like getting to connect like has always been my goal. Trying to grow confidence within people has always been a part of my mission with my YouTube channel. And being able to relate is another thing that I find very important. I really just wanna share with you some things that have been going on in my life that I feel like need to be brought up because, again, I don't feel like I'm the only person to be going through some of these things. Um, so the first thing I guess we could talk about is um, this past week or two. Um, so it started with my dad getting COVID, which obviously like isn't that big of a deal because many people are now being diagnosed with COVID and you know just quarantining and everything but that was pretty much the start of when everything started to go I guess like kind of downhill my dad now is fine he's over COVID but so my dad just got COVID and then at my school we were having some issues with racism and um some things were put in a boy's bathroom and um, I don't believe in anything that was said was okay at all and we've been in the news for it now so that's been a little bit stressful. We've had press conferences at our school with the NAACP and um, it's just been really uncomfortable I guess you could say going to school because there's just like a weird vibe that I can't really describe between the students and teachers and faculty. And um, that's been hard. And I believe that was brought up on like Tuesday throughout the week. So my dad got COVID on Sunday. This stuff was brought up on Tuesday. The NAACP was making statements on Wednesday and Thursday and like the news was coming and everything to our school. And then on Friday, we were in first period and we started to go into a lock-in so it's not a lockdown but it's just when like the school closes all the doors and locks them and no one can leave and it was because we had a rumor of shooter threats at our school which was very nerve-wracking but the police came and everything and then students were sent home because of everything that had been going on so all that had been going on and then I believe it was in, on Thursday my grandpa had fallen and had been taken to the hospital and needed to get surgery done um, on his neck and back so that was also running through my head but then on Sunday I got told that um, that Chesley the Miss USA 2019 had committed suicide and if you want to look up more on that you can but um that was also really hard because she was a role model to me. She was a D1 athlete and a lawyer and a social media influencer and everything that I kind of wanted to be when I got older. And so that was really hard to take in that news. So I decided that it was important for me to go talk to somebody. And so I started seeing a therapist this past Monday and I was very proud of myself because I had been struggling with some issues on whether or not I should go see a therapist or if I would get judged for that and what people would think when I was a freshman because I had some other things going on, you know, just getting used to high school and everything. And so once I heard about Chesley, I realized that I needed to go speak to someone because I just had a lot going on in my life and I still do. And even just like going to see someone to like talk to just to say things out loud, really like lifted a weight off my shoulders. And I think it's really important that whether you're moving away for college, like I am, 
or you're having a bad day maybe like a bad week at school like you're like you're struggling with like a class or a relationship and it's just not working out and you just want someone to talk to who wants the best for you but isn't like a parent like your mom you want to go see someone like a professional like i just really would recommend it i truly feel that it has made me better just in my one session just getting to speak out everything that had been going on and like hearing the person's like opinion on like how i've been handling situations and and stuff like that so that's been very helpful and i think it's not talked about enough mental health and i think that needing to understand that it's okay to talk to somebody like a professional like a therapist is very important because i was getting influence from my mom to go see someone when i was younger and i was like well what are people gonna think like no like i just i don't want to be judged like i don't want to be that person but after everything that had been going on in my life it was just a lot emotionally for me so understanding that like I, that was chesley dying was like my breaking point because seeing her on social media she looked so happy and for me like i try and make my videos as realistic to my life as i can so it's like i'm the same person on camera as off and just her passing away it just really clicked for me that social media is fake and that you can't just judge someone from what they post and that's really what made me want to go see somebody and talk to someone and so that's why i wanted to post this video as well because i just feel like you are so important to me that I needed to share this because what if, you know, like those what if situations. I just wanted to share this with you because I feel like it is important for people to know that it's okay to see somebody and talk to someone like a professional, whether you're just going through a hard time in your life, whether it be because of school or another stressor. But I just wanted to share with you my story and what I've been going through and really make social media for me more authentic with you. So, yeah.